Yeah, man, your right. cherry's been popped on multiple occasions, bro. What? His creative cherry, like the different so things. So anyway, um, tired of waiting to see the next episode reaction? Why not join the Patreon? You can gain access to reactions that have been uploaded weeks in advance before they land on YouTube. Most of all, you can watch the full-length versions without the annoying copyright filter and subpar audio for just $5 a month. If you want to take your loyalty even further, you can watch our non-animated related reactions as well as submit requests for just $10 a month. So stay ahead of the curve and help us sustain the brand. Thank, Thank you. you. Yo, what's going on, you guys? It's your boy RVG, aka the Red and Black Gamer, here with my lovely wife, Johnny Lee, on the ones and twos, and this is We Ain't Any Reactions, the place where we react to everything we ain't ever seen. <laughs> and as you can read by the title, it's time to get into some My Dress Up Darling reactions, man. Oh, man, that last episode got us in the feels, man. And we got a chance to see the high stakes now. It's not all about the typical antagonist to the protagonist and different villains and stuff like that sometimes it could just be the simple stuff where just things just don't life go right life reality. gets in the way of stuff yeah as we saw with gojo i want to say his grandpa got in the way you know it was an accident he fell down stuff happens you know it's like granddad seeing him looking at that damn weird ass game then he come home with stockings up in his bag yeah. And granddad just fell out. And something tells me too, it's like that that last episode had the overtone of lack of communication. That seems to be the lesson that that was just It's like yeah, echoing, lack of communication know? on both of their parts, but then again, Gojo is like very shut off and closed down. He's still not used to having a friend whatsoever. So now he's got a friend who wants to be in his life like this. It's still new to him, but last episode really spoke to me because it just reminded me of me especially when i was in like high school like my last two years of high school were very difficult and it just reminded me of just all the things you got to do all the responsibility that can be on you as a teenager before you even become an adult and you just be having to deal with it and sometimes you can just get lost and stuff can just happen so I really did enjoy last episode. I didn't even think I would enjoy it that much. Uh, yeah. As you can tell, once again, I have a nice uh, this nice neck brace on and another reaction. So that should just let you know how I'm feeling today. Right, I got that uh, neck brace on the little. I probably thing. got blue teeth. What do I got? You got a blue tone, looking oh. like um, my girl Liv Morgan I've been from eating WWE. This damn slushy. I had it around my neck. Anyway, I think we should get into it. Okay, go ahead, girl. Call the shot with it. I, I have to, because if not, you'll let us keep going for four minutes. Shit, I usually start at three. We gotta quit. Here we go, guys. Let's let's get it. <laughs> oh, boobs move like yours. Hey, puffu, puffu, puffu. Yes. I know damn well her titties don't be like that when she wear normal clothes. It's the boot bag, man. <laughs> the boot bag. That's what it's all about. Uh oh. Ooh, panty shots. <laughs> okay, how are you a tired. damn personal photographer then? Shit. Hey, go ahead and check in the gallery right quick. See if she got some spicy pictures. <laughs> yeah, that's the thing I've been thinking about. I wanted to take pictures of me, but you just be having me looking a mess. Whatever. I'm not a photographer, so. He ain't either. Don't have me comparing this damn cartoon to you. See, she already started, y'all. Trying to pick on Zaddy here. <laughs> Boy, I look a mess. Okay, uh, Kusanagi. Oh my god, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, this me. is like you. Why am I like both of these characters? You gotta get in character, my lady. There you go. Take a picture where you look like you're all confused. Mm -hmm. Yes, give me more of that, baby girl. Oh, yes. Slippery when wet. I love it. Uh, 
<laughs> okay. You look desperate right here. Give it to me. More of that. Right on my bed with it. I thought she already had an account. Okay, Maureen. I wonder if that's going to be doing the thing too, you know what I'm saying? They social media going to be popping. Boy, they didn't want, everybody going to want him to make their stuff. Yeah, man, that's the thing. Sis, let this man sleep. I like how it is when you're watching cosplay in an anime. It's like a reflection of real life, but it also feels like I'm jumping into different genres with the different types of characters these people cosplay as. Kishin, what are you at? Vanessa? Now you gotta wear that. Okay. Milk Marie, let's go. <laughs> what he look like, dude, from yes, jobless reincarnation. Yeah, got reincarnated like into this show. <laughs> he look like a neck mirror. I'm sorry, bro. Just kill me then. That's what you get. Just kill me. Just beat me up. <laughs> Woo! That, that, that tried to kill me, y'all. Mm. Ooh, Jesus. Let's go, man. You alright? No, I'm good. No, it's fine. Trying to take me up out of here. Got a high quality camera to do this shit. You gonna end up on YouTube, baby girl. Just YouTube don't end up on the pants. <laughs> Let's go. Come on, Pokemon Snap. Get your ass up in there. Yeah, man. Your right. cherry has been popped on multiple occasions, bro. What? His creative cherry, like the different so things. So anyway, um, I mean, you haven't never heard that before. His, um. Oh, what the hell am I trying to say? Right? Oh, you're trying you to express. You just threw me all off. How his cherry has been popped in terms of cosplay, the reactions, and all of that. And you over here thinking of dirty stuff. Yeah, whatever. Nobody uses cherry popped for anything other than that. No. You know what I mean. Mm -mm. Whatever. Ah. I'm just still amazed at the fact that she still got to go home and not have no damn eyebrows on her face. Arthur mode. It's like seeing all your hard work pay off. That's the best part. She gonna what if trip? I fall? I know, right? I'm waiting on it. She's hot. Literally and physically. The Yiddies is mousing. Where my man at? That's what she was saying to herself. <laughs> wow. Wardrobe malfunction? The top. Oh, okay. Are you fucking kidding me? Why would you do that? Take that shit off. Seriously, man. But that's the thing, though. People are always very meticulous and just particular about shit like that. Sweating like an old girl from prison school. Right. 
Both of y'all eating icy shit. Let us eat in peace. Yeah. Hey, jiggle with it. <laughs> Man, what they think they do? Don't know damn boobs move like that. I don't know. I think yours. Mine can. don't move like that either. She. So good. Go ahead and take it off, man. Let's go. But this is an urgent matter. Go ahead, man. Time is running out. Bro, let it go. Exactly. She's been to pass the hell out, and you trying to. Seriously. It's going to get stuck. Uh oh. <laughs> yes, the panties are drenched. Bruh, I thought I was the only Soaked one. Moisture. Condensation around the inner thighs, man. Let's get it. Uh oh, I like those pants, girl. Go ahead. Okay. I'm telling you, she gonna light up the whole blogosphere. Watch. Like, her shit gonna be going viral on Twitter or tweet or twerk, whatever they like to call this shit up in this universe. Hey, oh shit, she ain't got no draws like the. She got on short. I see. Snap it. Hey, what the fuck did that mean? <laughs> No, 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 don't you do that. Let me put them on all the fans. She is so oblivious. She is something else. It doesn't happen to me a few times, but I had no clue my skirt was all up, like in my nanny's funeral. Mm -hmm. <laughs> How'd she get eyebrows like that? Right? She just real pretty. She probably drew her own shit again. Just in a different color to match her hair. You didn't think this was a one time thing, now, did you? Seriously. Damn. Man, don't be putting too much pressure on my nigga, man. Y'all better communicate with this time. I just want to see how this is going to go when they post online. I'm trying to ra uh, imagine a real Japanese man just sitting on a train, like, with his friend yelling to her like that, and how I would be like, what's wrong with him? <laughs> Not knowing that he's just awkward like that. <laughs> yeah, he about to nose off. Yeah, I'm trying to play it off, man. You know what you're doing, bro. Go ahead and get some sleep. Hey, 
きなことしてる人しかいないの最高すぎるしあの空間にいるだけでめっちゃ上がったもんセイラユラニス基本しまどえなんでもいいんだけどセイラユラニス楽しんでる人めっちゃ好き Like Sailor Moon, Sailor Mercury. Mm hmm. 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 Mm hmm
you know, they can kind of be very gatekeeperish. So I wonder if that's going to be a thing, you know. Yeah, where, people be gatekeeperish over characters that they don't own rights yeah, to. Yeah, very fictitious characters that would you never know, exist on any planet anywhere in the actual universe. Exactly. But they'd be like, you're too dark to play in person. Yeah, I, I can't stand when people do that, guys. Like, that's why I will keep on just shouting his name on, on high. Like, my man Dwayne McDuffie, the great late. Dwayne McDuffie, the guy that made Static Shock, you know, when somebody asked him, how does it feel to know that a lot of black boys are going to dress up as your favorite character? And he just says, hey, I didn't make Static for that reason. I made Static for everybody to dress up as him, whether they be black, white, Mexican, Japanese, whatever, you know, and that's the thing. It's like <laughs> Spider-Man. Insert uh, Ahmed Johnson. <laughs> right. Black, white, Japanese. <laughs> Spell it. Yeah, but, you know, that's that's the thing, you know. I wonder if that's going to come into play, but I don't know. Like, the Japanese community just seems to be very different from how Western and other cultures view their art and, you know, their culture, you know, when it comes to, like, anime and uh, cosplay. So, we'll just have to see, man. I, I just think the possibilities the are endless. I people who are all like, you're yeah, too good. Yeah, yeah. I don't be seeing Japanese people giving a shit. I be seeing... I think we all know who it is. Yeah, it's like <laughs> we all know who it is. Japan, some some uh, c- uh, cosplay fans could be shit speckled Muppet farts, man. For whatever reason, they can be entitled. And then when you look at them and see how they really look, <laughs> it's like you have no reason to talk. But that's another topic for another, another day, guys. We got off day. on a tangent. Uh, anyways, um, yeah, I would give this episode an A plus. Would you give it? I want to give it an A. Okay, an A plus and an A. But yeah, man, there you have it. But anyways, guys, this is your boy RBG, aka the Random Black Gamer. Here are my lovely wife, Jenna Lee, on the ones and twos. And this is We Ain't Tated Reactions. We'll catch you guys on the next reaction too. My dress up, darling. Peace.